The number of Christians, unfortunately, never increased as well as in the Muslim community. We were born here, our ancestors lived here. We do not want to evacuate the old city from its Christians. And you as brothers and sisters in Christ, this is very important for you to have Christians in the Holy Land and to keep the testimony of Christ. You must leave your uh, job, you must leave the school, and you must leave your house. And your wife or your daughters must to be Muslims. Every child born out of marriage or being found in the streets or elsewhere considered Muslim as the religion of the state. Our main goal is to work with the different people here in Palestine with audiophonetic rehabilitation. This lady, she's four months pregnancy. And yesterday she had a car accident, which is a little bit dangerous for another. It was a different kind of pilgrimage, one where we visited people, those living stones in this land we call holy. We can, with the Jews, with Muslims, we can share this small piece of land. We should teach our children to respect the other, the different. Maybe he's a Jew, maybe he's a Muslim. Building bridges is very important between the, the communities here. Instead of building uh, walls, walls is very easy to build, but bridges maybe it's a little harder to meet in the bridge. Sooner or later, the cloud will go out and Spring will come to our country. These are the people who make this land holy. These are the people who inspire us to act with justice, to love mercy, and to walk humbly with our God.